New to Laravel 5.5 is something called package auto discovery. And this will allow us to really simply just pull a dependency down that we want to use with Composer. And as long as it's configured for package auto discovery within Laravel, our service providers and facades will be automatically registered. So this isn't something that's just going to happen. Uh, package providers will need to update their composer.json file. And we'll take a look at uh, the Laravel debug bar composer.json file in just a minute. So let's go and just pull this down. And I'm working with Laravel 5.5 at the moment. So what we're going to do is pull this down, wait for it to finish. And we literally do not need to do anything else. So once this has gone ahead and uh, installed, there's nothing else to do. It's really as simple as that. Okay, so now that that's done, of course, normally what we would have to do is come over to config and app. We'd have to scroll down and add in the specific service provider in here for this. And if we wanted to register the facade, we could go ahead and do that now. Now, what's happened in this case is this will have been automatically enabled for us. There's literally nothing we need to do. So this is a very small change. And of course, it's not that much trouble to go ahead and pull in a service provider and pull in a facade. Uh, but this, of course, uh, really helps just speed things up when you want to very quickly pull in a package, perhaps for prototyping. So let's go and just take a look at the composer.json file for Laravel debug bar. So if we head into the uh, folder for this here and look at the composer.json file and we scroll down to the extra section, you can see that we have a specific Laravel section here, which uh, describes where the providers are and any aliases. So this is essentially just the same as pulling this over into config and app, but these will be automatically registered for us. Now, like I said, this is entirely dependent on whether the package itself has this configured. So this won't be the case for everything. You'll just need to check the specific installation instructions for whichever package you're pulling down. Now, the question is, what happens if we don't want this to happen? What if we don't want this service provider to be automatically registered? And in this case for Laravel debug bar, I never actually register the facade for this. So in this case, what I'd probably do is go ahead and disable auto discovery, and then I would manually register the service provider. Now to do this, if we just come over to our own composer.json file, we need to create our own extra section just in here. So we can do that and we can create a Laravel section much like we saw over there. And then we create a don't discover section just here. And this will go ahead and list out all of the packages that we don't want to discover. So in here, we can go ahead and add in the package name for Laravel debug bar. So let's come down and quickly grab this full path to this, including the vendor name. And if we come over and remove this package and reinstall it like so, we won't see this auto discovered. So let's come over, give that a refresh. And of course it has gone. So of course, now what we would need to do is come over to config and app, register the service provider as usual, and then we're good to go. So, you know, you have that control there if you need it. Now, the really good thing I think about auto discovery is uh, if you've ever run into the problem where you remove a dependency and then things break, because of course you have the service provider already registered, then this can just be a little bit quicker. It's not to say that it's better, but it just means that if you go ahead and remove a package using composer and you still have that service provider or facade hanging around, then you won't see as many errors and you won't have to go back and fix stuff up. Again, this is purely preference. And if you didn't want to uh, enable this, you can go ahead and remove it as we've already discussed. So there we go. That is as simple as it gets. That's a package auto discovery in Laravel 5.5.